Mm. French President Emmanuel Macron announced that his state will transfer an undisclosed number of Mirage 2000 fighter jets to Ukraine, as well as train pilots to fly these aircraft. According to Forbes, the deal on Mirage aircraft has been prepared for many months. According to Macron, Ukraine will receive Mirage 2000 to 5 fighters, which are optimized for air combat, and not the old Mirage 2000C fighters or Mirage 2000D air-to-ground attack aircraft. All variants have the same basic shape and characteristics, a tailless delta wing, a single engine, a multi-mode radar on the nose and supersonic speed. The choice of the variant makes sense. The French Air Force has retired the last few vintage Mirage 2000C aircraft from the 1980s in 2022. Last year, a French official said only 13 Mirage 2000CS still had little potential. The French Mirage 2000-5 fighters, out of 37 Dassault fives built for the French Air Force in the 1990s, that have survived until this time, must be taken out of service by 2029. But French Defense Minister Sébastien Lecornu said their replacements, the new Dassault Rafales, could arrive earlier. There is no reason why France could not provide the Ukrainian Air Force with several dozen Mirage 2000-5 aircraft. This number would be enough to replace the existing Ukrainian fighter brigade or form a new brigade. The Ukrainian Air Force entered the war in February 2022, armed with about 125 combat aircraft, including Su-24 and Su-25 attack aircraft and Su-27 and MiG-29 fighters. During 28 months of fierce fighting, the Ukrainians lost about 80 aircraft, but replaced most of them with aircraft donated by Macedonia, Poland, and Slovakia, as well as with older aircraft they pulled out of long-term storage and restored to airworthy condition, the story says. New reinforcements are on the way. Belgium, Denmark, the Netherlands and Norway have pledged dozens of Lockheed Martin F-16s, the first of which should arrive in a few weeks, around the same time the first group of Ukrainian pilots. Complete training in the US, Denmark and Romania. France or another country operating the Mirage 2000, such as Greece, will have to train Ukrainian crews on the Delta Wing aircraft. This may take some time, perhaps a year or more. But unless there is a shock Russian victory or a definite negotiated end to the war, the Mirage 2000 must eventually fly into battle over several hundred kilometers of front line in Ukraine. The advantages of this type of aircraft are well known. French Air Force Colonel and Labadee explained in an interview with Combat Aircraft that the Dash 5 is a fairly old aircraft, but it is also specialized. This is an aircraft designed exclusively for air defense, and its pilots specialize in this, she said. If the Mirage 2000 were available to Ukraine today, it is clear that the military would fly sorties against the Russian Air Force's Sukhoi fighter bombers, which mercilessly bomb Ukrainian troops and civilians with thousands of guided bombs every month. 